The universe is far more complex and mysterious than we can comprehend. Despite our advancements in science and technology, around 14 billion years ago, the event we now call the Big Bang set the universe into motion. Yet, even today, we don't truly know what came before this moment or why it occurred. While the universe continues to expand, one of the most profound questions in science remains unanswered. Why did the Big Bang happen? One significant challenge in understanding the Big Bang is that we cannot directly observe it. Our knowledge comes primarily from mathematical models and indirect evidence. However, the James Webb Space Telescope JWST has revolutionized the way we study the universe, taking us closer than ever to unraveling the mysteries of its origin, the significance of the Big Bang. The Big Bang Theory is the prevailing explanation for how the universe came to be. In essence, it posits that the universe began as an incredibly small, infinitely dense, and unimaginably hot point. From the singularity, a rapid expansion began, which set the foundation for everything we know today. Initially, this expansion occurred at speeds beyond comprehension. Over the course of 13.7 billion years, it slowed to a more manageable rate, leading to the ever-expanding universe we observe today. Although we cannot see the very moment of the Big Bang due to current technological limits, we have compelling evidence of the universe's expansion through the Cosmic Microwave Background, CMB, a faint afterglow from the early universe. Discovered accidentally in the 1960s, the CMB remains one of the strongest confirmations of the Big Bang, cosmic inflation, and the birth of matter. The story of the Big Bang involves several critical stages. Initially, the universe experienced a phase of exponential expansion known as cosmic inflation. Proposed by physicist Alan Goose in 1980, this theory describes a rapid growth that lasted mere fractions of a second. This phase was crucial in shaping the structure of the universe. Following inflation, a process called reheating occurred, during which matter and radiation began to form. In the first seconds after the Big Bang, the universe was a seething mass of particles like neutrons, protons, and electrons, all interacting in extreme temperatures exceeding 10 billion degrees Fahrenheit. At this stage, light could not travel freely because free electrons scattered photons in all directions, much like sunlight scatters through clouds. As the universe cooled over the next 380,000 years, electrons combined with nuclei to form neutral atoms, allowing light to travel freely. This event marked a turning point and gave rise to the CMB, a phenomenon that continues to intrigue scientists. The role of the James Webb Space Telescope. On July 12, 2022, NASA unveiled the first images captured by the James Webb Space Telescope, including breathtaking views of the Carina Nebula, the Eight Burst Nebula, and Stefan's Quintet. Among these discoveries, the telescope also identified the oldest galaxy ever observed, formed just 300 million years after the Big Bang. The JWST is positioned 1.5 million kilometers from Earth at a point known as Lagrangian Point 2, where gravitational forces from the Earth and the Sun balance perfectly. Unlike its predecessor, the Hubble Space Telescope, which primarily observes visible and ultraviolet light, the JWST focuses on the infrared spectrum. This capability allows it to peer deeper into the universe's past, capturing light that has traveled billions of years to reach us. The telescope's primary mission includes studying the formation of galaxies, stars, and planetary systems, as well as investigating the origins of the universe itself. Its advanced design features an array of 18 hexagonal mirrors arranged in a honeycomb pattern, significantly larger than Hubble's main mirror. This configuration enables JWST to gather 6.25 times more light, making it capable of observing faint, distant objects that Hubble could not, challenging our understanding of the universe. The JWST has already provided insights that challenge existing models of the universe. For instance, it has observed massive galaxies from the first 500 to 700 million years after the Big Bang. These galaxies are unexpectedly large and dense, with some rivaling the Milky Way in mass. 
Their discovery raises questions about how such massive structures could form so soon after the universe's birth, forcing scientists to reconsider theories about galaxy formation. Additionally, the telescope's ability to observe objects with significant redshift, where light stretches into longer wavelengths due to the universe's expansion, has opened new doors for studying the earliest stages of cosmic history. By capturing images from just 100 to 250 million years after the Big Bang, the JWST is helping astronomers piece together the puzzle of how the first stars and galaxies emerged. The Legacy of Hubble and the Future of Astronomy The Hubble Space Telescope paved the way for many of these discoveries, capturing images of galaxies like GNZ-11, which existed when the universe was only 400 million years old. However, its limitations left many questions unanswered. With the JWST, scientists are uncovering a universe far more complex than previously imagined. Its findings suggest that galaxies form earlier and in greater numbers than expected, challenging long-held assumptions about the early universe. The James Webb Space Telescope represents a new era in astronomy, offering unparalleled opportunities to explore the cosmos. From studying distant exoplanets to unraveling the mysteries of dark matter and supermassive black holes, its contributions will reshape our understanding of the universe for generations to come. What other secrets will the JWST reveal about the cosmos? Only time will tell. For now, we stand on the brink of discovery, gazing deeper into the universe than ever before driven by humanity's insatiable curiosity about where we come from and where we are headed.